It's actually Chief without his helmet on. <laughs> Hold on a second. Now he's just Now you guys <laughs> Here we go. Oh, what? <laughs> the sky box. <laughs> it's perfect. Cortana to Kilo Actual. Perfect timing. We are all done here and ready for dust off. Hey, keep your oh, oh, yeah, All right. All right. Let's go. <laughs> you like You're that. doing great. <laughs> You're doing great. You, like that. you keep That's driving so like it's Halo. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, you know, Chief, I'm nice it. on the Get sticks, but I would feel kind of bad beating the purveyors <laughs> of the Halo. That's right. I won't feel bad at all, don't worry. Looks like a and I kind of want to see that lobby again, because I haven't been over it. Oh, all right. <laughs> see what you're doing, and I like it. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. <laughs> you like, you like that? Oh, really? Okay. This ring is go nuclear uh, early results. Brian and T on top. Halo has the 343 team hasn't driven yet, so we'll have to see how they do. Roger that, Cortana. Hoorah! Look at these ancient dwellings. It almost looks like something lives here. The chaos. Yeah, but you don't get that. Awesome. Awesome. We've got a better chance of avoiding those banshees off road. They're saying Warthog seems a lot quicker now. Hoorah! So, oh, look at that! So Whoa, the. Banshees. So Chris Phillips, the handling designer at Playground, Ooh, yeah, he has done an amazing job. Not, just, yeah, not only the, the Halo Warthog, but like trees. all the cars on the roster. There was there was a time when you know I was tapping people on the shoulder, like, man, you know, do we have like an all new handling model? Because it's it's been improved so much. Really, I feel Banshees, really, really, really good. The Warthog is actually one of the better models in the game. So we're well, looking for. You know, a beast. This is Cortana it's going to be all competitive. I'm sending well, you coordinates for really, an really LZ. Requesting immediate yeah. evac. Repeat. All air support units to the LZ. Uh, and near and dear to my heart, we love to come up with canonical reasons for everything. Okay. Uh, I love this. <laughs> but uh, we actually did some cool stuff. The Warthog is scaled just a little bit differently we actually have it modeled canonically as a uh like a civilian transport kind of stripped down version as well so the cst versus the fav uh, which typically has some uh extra lethal accoutrements uh up on the uh, uh, you know on the on the back uh <laughs> But yeah, so there's, uh, it does, it is a little Freaky. faster. It is a little faster. But it's also a little bit smaller wow. than yeah. a typical. Yeah, it's around 20, 25 percent, right? I believe, uh, oh, oh, oh. smaller. Because, because yeah. Spartans are like eight feet tall, right? That is the problem, yeah. yes, uh, is if you scale it uh, to a Spartan like we have to do in our games, uh, it really just looks like you have a bunch of four-year-olds <laughs> who can't uh, reach the wheel. <laughs> driving a Hummer, yes. Yeah. <laughs> Which, while hilarious. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> But I've seen some of the videos that uh, that you guys have of uh, people just sitting in the Halo, and they, you know, that thing is, uh, the, it's, massive. it's massive. Oh yes, yeah. yeah. I, like so I do feel like a small child <laughs> in, the, in the real life. We showed it in that video. Oh, uh, look at that! Let's go! Oh my God! That is awesome. T, you're doing pretty well. I'm so yeah. jazzed about an this. Early, an early mishap, but I think you're making up for I, it. I want yeah. it to be competitive. Yeah, this feels good. Okay, intentional. <laughs> right, yeah, 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 that's nice. That's nice. Yeah, uh -huh. <laughs> Scarlet Pimple says, love the ring in the sky. They're, looking, they're loving that authenticity. Do we have, uh, will Halo music be included? Uh, is, is a we question. Also, we also uh, will hear yeah, the, the Halo it. track during this yeah. event. Yes. Wow. Oh. Yes. That's right. We do, we also, do have the character kind of evolved into really having a personal relationship with the Chief uh, and their kind of friendship and working relationship really formed a really interesting emotional and narrative foundation for the series going forward. So it was, uh, in some ways, from a gameplay perspective, it was awesome to have somebody in your ear oh, helping you. Him. Nice. 
uh, helping you to know like where certain enemies were, or what to do, uh, go to the next checkpoint, or yeah. kind of how to tackle. But uh, also from a story players, and a world of, yeah. and immersion perspective, it was cool to kind of have this character uh, that went through you through several, uh, you know, that you went through several games uh, with. So. And just like my Master Chief, Cortana sort of become iconic, an iconic character for the Halo. Yeah. Halo series. Yeah, no, ab absolutely, uh, and and uh, has come in many forms. Uh, mm -hmm. We've uh, we've seen her be your friend. We've seen her be otherwise. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> just like I'm a real relationship. Uh, you know, it's <laughs> you got ups and downs. What happens if you pass <clears throat> everybody? Mission successful. That's what happens. Um, I want the last name to be Carlos. <laughs> oh, the no, final, no, final no, boss. I, <laughs> I love these hard light guardrails. Yeah, uh, these here. are great. These are fantastic. Um, I'm sorry, Jeff. I, I'm sweating all over this controller. And oh, I'm yeah, hand sorry. It to you. I'm going to hand yeah. it to you in mere moments. Mm -hmm. It's going to be like holding dying. on to an, an oil true. flick. I'm just going to grab it, the controller's yeah, going right. to shoot to the back. Out of your yeah. hands. But I thought I'd go first person here, just to give uh, everybody the more immersive Warthog experience. Which is funny because uh, oh, look at that. We, you, know, you don't get to drive the Warthog in first person in Halo. That's right. Yeah, which That's is. Right. Uh, it's always interesting. Well, I think I've only got it. Oh, where am I? I'm at 80%. Uh, we see little I known fact, more. Brian is yes. the Stig. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> I'm, the, I'm the Master Stig. Master Stig, they call me. This People wanting to know when this is set during the Halo lore. It's actually oh. set uh, 500 years before the events of Halo Combat Evolved. Uh, <laughs> is that, are you being serious? Do you guys have to <laughs> canonize this as well? I have to canonize everything that I'm asked in chat. It's in the contract. Is uh, that right? Yeah, it's, oh, it's I love it. something about that. That's fantastic. What a great question. <laughs> well, it certainly feels like a big, heavy machine. I will say that to you. This feels like what you would expect the Warthog to feel like. I want to say it feels a little heavier than Forza Horizon 3. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, and it's still got some punch, but you know, the Warthog's never been the fastest thing on four wheels, but it definitely no. feels solid. Yes. It felt like you could flip right, it you a lot. A, yeah. I think it's 323.33. Right. Right. Oh, there is a time. Yeah, see, there we go.